Welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Sandy, a visual artist here on the internet. I do digital paintings and I'm still exploring the art world and figuring out my style of work. So a few months back, I applied for an art show that happens here in Kentucky where I currently stay every October. So it happens at the end of the first week in October. And the name of this art show is called the St. James Art Fair. Surprisingly, when I applied for this art show, I had a lot of doubts that I wasn't going to get in. Um, I don't know why, but um, luckily I said my prayers and I submitted my application for the art show and I got accepted. So I received the email telling me congratulations, uh, your application went through, you were, you were selected as one of the artists to participate in the art show. It was really exciting for me, but then at the same time, it was just like a wild moment because I literally remember praying to God about opening doors for art. I, I literally remember praying to God about things like this that happened. So I was really grateful to be able to have this opportunity to showcase my work to thousands of people. And so I heard about the art show from a couple of my co-workers and you know they kept telling me about this art show after I told them I'm an artist and I do paintings and stuff and when I found out when it was going to happen and how do I get into it I went ahead and just applied for it the art show usually bring in about two over 200,000 attendees every year that that is a lot of people I, I was even trying to imagine how like how many people that is compared to a football stadium that's that's about how many people attend this art show so in a way just having thinking do i even have enough artwork to bring to this art show leading up to the art show is roughly less than three weeks away and i have been preparing for it i was able to work on some abstract paintings and some of my other paintings I have that I want to take for display and some will also be going up for sale. So I have an Oprah painting that I took to the, the first art show I went for, for earlier this year in Chicago. I have a video of that art show on my YouTube channel, so if you want to check it out, try not to really overthink it, but at the same time, I want to present myself in the best way possible. So doing some research on what type of artwork would I want to sell at this art show or what type of artwork do I have in my portfolio that I want to take for sale. A few abstract paintings so I realized okay maybe I will do a little bit more abstract paintings because I know with abstract paintings it's up to the viewers to really interpret how the one what, what the artwork means to them. So people have different perspectives on it. So I think it's really gonna be up to whoever sees the artwork and how how they want it, how they want to perceive that artwork. I've also been exploring a little bit more into the marketing aspect of my work. Okay, how am I gonna market my work? What type of banner do I wanna have up? And the pricing of my artwork is so much more talk that I'm trying to put into it leading up to the art show. I will try to make a review video of this art show or just do a little bit of videography work while the art show is happening. So yeah, if you've been following me, if you, if you would like to come for this show, I will post the dates and the time of this show on my Instagram. So if you want to come check out some of the artworks I will have on the show or if you just want to attend the show. The good thing is the art show is free, so if you're closer to Kentucky, and you want to come check it out you are more than welcome and yeah that is what's happening for this art show stay tuned for more videos coming up here on my youtube channel i will try to upload more of the artworks that i'm working on and other projects here on my youtube channel so yeah i will talk to you in the next video thanks for watching have a nice day